Alright. What's up guys, wonderful boy here. I am back more with more Modern Warfare 3. I'm using the PPM1. Or PP90 M1. This was a pretty aggressive game and I had a really a lot of fun with this one. And uh, it was a really nice game. I really well look at that jump shot. Uh, I did fast forward parts of the game, so if you're wondering, yeah, um, I fast forward a few parts, so just in case you guys know. Uh, today I wanted to talk about rushing, and a lot of people have a lot of misconception about rushing in this game. Now, rushing to me is, you, is I'm a runner general. That's how I play, and look at that night. And I just love to be in people's spawn. I love to flank the enemy. I just love to do stuff like that. So uh, you you know how I play. If if you saw how I play, especially with the PP90 M1 and uh, MP7 and the P90 itself, it's they're all good for rushing. Uh, usually when I rush, I like to use their really aggressive class, which is of course the slide of hand, uh, slide of hand quick draw and steady aim, or even Earth Stalker depends. But I recommend steady aim for SMGs. And then I put specialist, and when I get all the perks, it's just mayhem dude and you see my little setup there i use assassin scavenger and a extra condition the reason why i use that in my specials package is because assassin helps you stay off the radar and you see look at that i got all the perks um you want to really get all the perks and you want to stay off the radar so people don't find you especially if you're rushing you don't want to rush them blindly so be careful when you're rushing also because don't rush too hard or else you're gonna die look at that awesome drop shot um, so just don't rush too hard and you'll do really well and um, uh, I use scavenger because this thing burns ammo and you just need more ammo on this thing and look at that well, tell me what that was I knifed the guy and I got a hit marker tell me what that was leave a comment tell me what that was anyways lastly use extreme conditioning of course for rushing but I wouldn't use it first because I really need sleight of hand and uh, I, I just play really good with sleight of hand Next, um, I mean, uh, you can't really rush with assault rifles. People say you can rush with assault rifles. I don't rush with assault rifles. I actually just play aggressive with any type of assault rifle. Especially the, M M the M4, it's really good for rushing. Uh, you can really rush really well with it. Um, this game was actually quite real, uh, really aggressive in my opinion. I was really doing well. And I was just having a blast too. And... Another thing I like to talk about is, uh, I don't really know, actually. Um, I like to talk about the, uh, the Kimba 59 and stuff. I know people are saying it's overpowered. I've said it in a few of my Modern Warfare 3 videos. But it's just not really overpowered. I mean, sure, it's really strong. I know. It, it's like, I told you, it's like my model of the G18s, but it's just in this game. Because the G18s had amazing range in Modern Warfare 2, and I just love those Kimba. And uh, people thought those were overpowered, so I mean, I really don't see you guys complaining about all this stuff. It's really just personal preference. I, mean, I I just love using them. I like the MP9 too. It's another good machine pistol. But other than that, what else would I like to talk about? Oh, I actually want to talk about my favorite guns in Modern Warfare 3. I have a lot, and I mean, I like a lot of guns in this game. Now, uh, really, if we start from the assault rifle category, I really like. Um, all the assault rifles excluding um, the M16 because I think the M16 in this game really sucks. Uh, I mean, it's just that if you have a high sensitivity with it, you're not really going to do it good with the M16. I didn't really like it. And look at that Motakyu. Nice one from that guy, Stealth Bomber. And uh, uh, Dylan has a series called Multi Wednesday. If you guys like to check it out, go to his channel. Uh, I don't know if he's gonna post them because I had a, I think I had like a five man or four man care package uh, on drop. It was a, it was a really good uh, game. So my setup on here, of course, I haven't even talked about my setup. Look at that! Oh, I can't believe! Oh my god! How did that guy not see me? How did you not see me, dude? He really, he must really suck, especially for. Missing that I drop shot the mess up. Uh, actually, when I, I have two aggressive classes for the P uh, the PP90 one because uh, usually I like sometimes I would like to go stealthy like I'm doing right now in this game, but sometimes I like to go really aggressive. So the first one I use, of course, is this class, of course, and it has the suppressor and um, rapid fire. 
And I always have rapid fire on this gun because it's just so good, especially in close range. I take off people really fast. So really, I don't really aim with this gun unless I really have to, but I really just hit fire uh, mainly uh, because it's just these tip firing with this thing. Uh, and then my second class I usually use extended mag and um, rapid fire, of course. Uh, the extended mag is like just so uh, spray and per or not spray and per at least run a gun a lot and I mean like a lot like a boss and just do really well with it so um I really love the PM PP90 M1 is probably my favorite gun in the game um, because it's it's just overall great it's like my favorite it's just awesome I, I get a gold all the time in every prestige it's really good gun. And I, I recommend it to anybody. It's a, you get it really early in the prestige, so I really recommend using it through your whole prestige. Try and get it gold every prestige because this thing is just a deadly boss. And I uh, just keep using it. Uh, look at that. You see, you got all your perks. You see, assassin really helps uh, keep you off the radar when you get all the perks. I, I thought I could get an MOAB or something. But, uh, that's another thing. MOABs. Uh, I had actually few people come and ask me, uh, Zach, are you going to do MOAVs? And the thing with me for uh, the MOAVs is that I really can't get them because I'm always near them, but I never get them. Look at that. D <laughs> double spray. But, um, I really never get them, and that's what I hate the most. I really want to get an MOAV. It's, like my, it's been like my dream to get an MOAV. I really want one. And I just want to be a boss. Like everybody else has an MOAB. I just want to get one. I've gotten a few nukes in MW2, but the MOAB is just cool. I got it in private match, of course, but that doesn't count. I'm thinking about doing private match videos, actually. I was probably playing Infected and things. I had a lot of, I have a lot of fun when we play it. Maybe you can hear a lot of people rage over, oh, so you affected me. He sucks. And this was a really close game. I did really well. Um, Dylan actually was in this game with me. He was sucking like a boss. <laughs> so, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I, I hope you guys liked the video. I'll have more mom for three gameplay up. I know this wasn't full screen and stuff, but I'll have more gameplay up. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I went 46 and 10.